I feel like I'm always starting my videos by saying, oh my god, I haven't done a video like this in forever, but this is one of those rare times where this intro isn't a lie. The last time I made a video talking about this subject was back in November of 2017. And now it's February 2019. And the subject I am going to be discussing today is writing. So the last writing video I made, like I said, it was back in November of 2017. And it was when I announced that I was doing a third draft of Golden Death. And now here I am like a year and a few months later and draft three is finally done. Now you may be wondering, Courtney, you easily could have made writing update videos throughout 2018. And I know that because the idea obviously crossed my mind of, oh, I could talk about Golden Death draft three and how that's going or like other writing ideas or whatever. I could have done something, but I never did. <laughs> I think the reason why I never made any writing videos last year was just because, you know, I was working on Golden Death Draft 3 all of last year and I just finished it this past week and it really stressed me out. So if I did make a write update about it, it would just be me screaming about how stressed out I was. But now I am calm. I am, I can talk about this because the draft is over and thank god it is. <laughs> so I'm gonna be talking about Golden Death draft three today, final word count, chapters, how do I overall feel about it, future of Golden Death, writing plans, all that stuff. So let's just get started. So Golden Death draft three ended at 87,065 words, which Sounds obviously like a lot, but honestly, this draft I think is the shortest out of the three because my other two drafts were huge, but this one, I cut so much stuff out. There are 59 chapters in this book. I don't know how many chapters there were in my other two drafts because I didn't number the chapters in the other two, but in this one, I decided to number them because it just got really confusing in the other two drafts to figure out like how many chapters were. So I was like, I'm gonna number this. I'm really glad I did. I still have seven point of views in this draft that did not change. All my main characters have a point of view in this book. So Markia, Brecken, Dayton, Serna, Yana, Felina, Gail. Oh my god, I have so many characters. I don't know out of the seven who has the most chapters. If I had to guess, I would probably say Markia because she is technically like my main character. So you see a lot from her perspective. And honestly, I like write from her point of view anyway, because she's just really easy. And I feel like I just know her and I know what she's doing. Well, obviously I know her because like I brought her to life, obviously, but you know what I mean. But while writing this particular draft, I think my favorite character to write from was probably Felina because she's like the funny character out of the group, I guess. She just like keeps things real and I was just very entertained by her and she has a very interesting storyline, you know. She's just been through a lot and she's keeping a lot of secrets and it's just really fun to write from her perspective. Now I'm gonna talk about the plot, which I'm not gonna reveal a lot about it because while writing this draft, I cut out so much stuff from the original two that Golden Death Draft 3 honestly looks like a new book. What's so interesting to me is that I cut out this very minor detail in this draft and somehow this minor detail like changed the course of everything so I had to rewrite so much new stuff that it was crazy. And I also added in a lot of stuff from Silver Blood which is the second book I've written one draft of that and I had so much stuff in that draft because I was just trying to put in all my ideas and so when I started this draft, I was like, 
hey, we can move some stuff over here so like it flows better. So a lot of Silver Blood things are now in Golden Death and it's a whole which is amazing. But since I'm not gonna be revealing much of the plot, just because I don't want to spoil the new things that I have added in to go to death, I've written a summary for you all. This summary is really short and it's not the best, but you know, it gets the job done. And so this is a summary of Golden Deaths. Marcus Stonefall at the age of 14 found a map which she believed to be trash, only to discover that it was a treasure map. Three years later, and she has still not started the journey towards finding the island. Ready for an adventure, old and new friends join together to begin what seems to look like a journey of a lifetime, but destiny always has other ideas. So that's a summary of Golden Death. I know it's short and also vague, but that's kind of the point. Now that Golden Death Draft 3 is over, the plan is to just chill and relax because, oh my god, this draft stressed me out so much. <laughs> this draft just took a lot out of me like I was emotionally drained when I finished it this past Sunday I was like oh my god like I just felt a weight lifted off my shoulders and yes I love writing I love golden deaths this is like my heart but at the same time this draft was really trying to kill me so now that it's over I'm gonna just sit back and relax I'm gonna do some reading and then I'm gonna start thinking about what I want to do for the next draft of Silver Blood, the second book, because I'm gonna have to chop that baby up as well and I don't want to do that right now. But I will definitely start the next draft of Silver Blood maybe in a month or two. I just, I gotta relax for a second. So the plan is to chill, then do Silver Blood draft two and hopefully that doesn't take as long because I really want to write a first draft of the final book because I haven't written anything about that book and I really want to because I have so many ideas about the end and I just want to write them out. But yeah, lots of crazy good writing things are happening and I'm really excited to see the future of the Golden Death universe because I love this world so much and if you guys want to learn more about it I am free to talking about it in the comments down below and if you want to read the book let me know because I might publish it on the internet only if people say that they want to read it but that my friends was my first writing update in a million years I hope you all enjoyed this video. Thank you all so much for watching this video and supporting me and my writing. I hope you all enjoyed this and I am Courtney and I'll see you all next time when we do video soon. So I will see you then. So bye!